Hello everyone, I'm Alicia Anderson and welcome to the Fort Report. It's swimming season again and the Fort Worth Drowning Prevention Coalition and Fort Worth Fire Department are busy educating kids and parents for swimming pool safety. Texas is number one in the country for pool drownings as uh, reported by the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission. And when you look at the statistics on the Texas Department of Family and Prevention Services, we still, as a county, rank number two behind Harris for pediatric drownings. Two seconds is too long to turn your back on a child in water. Drowning is not what you see in the movies, okay? The movies are there for a dramatic effect, but in real life, drowning is very much different. Okay, a drowning victim, drowning is very deceptively quiet. You don't see the splashing and the yelling and the screaming for help because there's a condition that happens in your body called the instinctive drowning response. And basically what this is, it's an autonomic response, which means that your body has no control over it. Adult supervision around the pool at all times is very important. If you bring your family to the pool, leave the phone in your pocket, leave the magazines behind, or come with a water watcher tag. And what those tags are is that is a symbol that if I have that tag wrapped around my wrist, I am the person in charge of watching the children in the pool at that time. If I need to go and take a phone call or go to the restroom, then I pass that water watcher tag on to another responsible adult. So at all times, keep eyes on children around water. The Fort Worth Drowning Prevention Coalition and the Fort Worth Fire Department offer safe swim programs around the city throughout the summer. Today we're going to start uh, discussing with them and teaching them uh, back float. And that's designed if they were to inadvertently fall into the water, they would be able to flip from their tummy to their back and yell for help. Every single evening we have content experts discussing water safety issues with the adults while we have the children and adult non-swimmers in the pool teaching them drowning prevention skills. Even if you know how to swim, nobody's ever drown proof or waterproof. Even if you know how to swim, you're still just as likely to drown as somebody else. So with that being said, you have to know your limitations. Visit Fort Worth Drowning Prevention Coalition's website for more information and for safe swim programs schedule. Here's a look at other events happening in and around Fort Worth in the next few weeks. For a listing of more events, you always can check the website.